everyone okay so today's tutorial is based on the Jennifer Lopez dance again music video there are lots of looks going on in this video and rather than douse Lisa in glitter what we're going to go for is the very strong brown crease so the first thing I'm going to do is apply some moisturizer to Lisa's face and this is just to let the foundation adhere and go on a little bit more smoothly I'm going to be using a cream foundation and I'm not going to be using a lot of it because I'm going to start to build up color with a powder bronzer so I'm just using a very small amount to just cover any areas of redness or discoloration so I'm going to apply a little bit more to the chin and then we're going to just lightly powder the face now normally I powder with a powder and a puff but because Lisa doesn't have any redness in the face it's not necessary to use a puff because sometimes with powder and a brush when you put it to the skin you can pull away the foundation and you're left with the redness again so this is why I'm using the brush because her skin's pretty perfect as it is just taking the hair away I'm gonna to start to bronze the skin up now and we're gonna alter it by two or three shades to just really give a very very summery glow because obviously Jennifer Lopez is usually very tanned so this is the look we're gonna kind of recreate I know I keep going on about it but it's very important that the face and body match when you're altering the skin tone so if we were just to do the face it would look very very odd so continually bronze the skin until you're happy with the shade obviously the paler you are the, le the less amount you want to use I'm going to apply some shimmer to the forehead and then to the cheekbones and after this I'm going to apply the shimmer down the bridge of the nose because Jennifer Lopez is always very shiny there we go and this is a Ray Morris small kabuki brush I'm applying blusher in a very bronze shade to the cheeks and just into the temple area as well and then I'm going to use a cream eyeshadow and I'm going to apply this just to the eyelid and we're then going to go over this to reinforce it and stop it creasing with a silver eyeshadow a just slightly off silver eyeshadow and just apply this to the entire mobile lid next I'm going to apply a little bit of powder to prevent some fallout but as you'll see later on I will wipe this off anyway so it was completely unnecessary really I'm just going to take a black pencil and line the upper part of the lash line I'm then going to take a push liner brush and just push some black shadow into this to reinforce it so it doesn't smear taking a crease brush I'm applying a very very hard crease starting from the outside of the eye and working the entire way around the socket it's very important with this look that the line isn't overly blended because it's a very strong line there's a very distinct line between the crease and the brow then apply this to the outside corner of the eye as well so just kind of bring it down and into a slight V just go lightly underneath with a pencil brush of the same color and line the inner water lines with a black coal pencil as you can see Lisa is laughing away I cannot stress how stressful this tutorial was because all we did was laugh as you'll see in another tutorial just wiping away any of that excess and then applying some more of this foundation and to act as a concealer just to clear up and brighten up under the eye ever so slightly what's left on the brush that had the bronzer on I'm just very lightly going to tap under the eyes so that there's no reverse circles or anything nasty like that I'm applying Tom Ford lip gloss to the lips in a bronzy pink tone I'm just gonna fill in the eyebrows slightly because I think they look best just as they are but Lisa really likes them kinda of sculpted in a coat of mascara and this is by Lancome which is hers and here's a before and here's an after and thanks for watching and I'll see you next time bye bye See what colour this is? Can't put black back on. Oh, you're getting what you're getting. You just gently stroke it. <laughs> Jesus. Mm. Look, I went you're to, putting the light there, right? I went to, I went to Tiger Productions and I wonder why they never called me back about the show that they wanted me on. Open. Oh, that was nice, wasn't it? That's what I'm here for. Open wide, please. Stop it. Thank you. Wide. Oh. <laughs> you said wide. <laughs> Not quite so wide. Just Not too much tooth either. <laughs>
How am I going to edit this? Yeah. Oh, well done. Can't Those, to be honest, you. they really bring out the grey. That's what they do, it's supposed to. <laughs> this is why, right, it's good to have your hair type out. Because now they'll be like, look at her thinking she's someone. Did you it? Haven't even, you didn't do it. I did, so, I did, did, did it won't. Do it again. <sighs> okay, you did it. <laughs>